This is for IT professionals, IT manager, IT admin. If you are an IT um, professional in your company and looking to get Cyber Essentials certification done, what do you need? You know, we speak to a number of IT professionals and one thing we come across more often is they're not sure what exactly they need to get Cyber essential certification done, right? So the base, there are two, uh, two levels of certification, Cyber Essentials Basic and Cyber Essentials Plus. Basic one, you can do it yourself. It's, it's pretty straightforward. Self-assessment questionnaire that covers all these five areas. It will ask you a number of questions. And if you, um, as I said, if you're an IT professional in your company, you should have most of them in place already. And you know, you send that questionnaire away to certification body, and they will issue the certificate, uh, do the external scan, and issue the certificate. Straightforward, right? But most people are not sure what is involved in Cyber Essentials Plus, which is more advanced. Let me tell you something. <laughs> Here is a surprise for you. The process is exactly same. The same things involved in Cyber Essentials Plus as well. The only difference is the assessor, the person from cyber, uh, the certification body will come in and verify whatever you said on the questionnaire. So you will still do the self-assessment questionnaire, send it to the certification body and we, um, we are an assessor for um, um, the, the cyber essentials and we will come on site and we will verify whatever you said. If you said you have a password policy and you have enforced it, you have, you know, um, we will collect a screenshot for it. If you said you have a anti, um, antivirus software uh, and the, the firewalls enabled, we will collect, uh, we'll take a screenshot of that. You know, um, you, if you said you have, um, firewall uh, number of uh, ports opened and firewall rules properly configured then we will collect a, a, a screenshot of that so 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 on and so forth and the most most companies that struggle with is um, this part here the patch management that's where the most companies struggle with um, <clears throat> number of uh, com uh, people we spoke to is that, oh, we, our patches are not up to date. Uh, we don't update them, uh, you know, as soon as they are available. You don't need to, uh, it is 14 days. You should be updating your patches in 14 days of being available, the critical updates. What we do as part of the process is we run a vulnerability scan on selected devices, only PCs, not servers, um, per build. So, um, if you have Windows 7, Windows 10, Windows 8, we'll probably pick one in each or a couple, couple uh, of the devices in each. And we'll do a scan and that scan will tell us how, uh, you know, what applications you have and what are, um, behind, you know, what vulnerabilities are there and what updates are available and all that. Right. So this is the most part. If you think your systems are up to date, then you can get the certification pretty easy right there is no penetration testing involved it is just a patch management will do a vulnerability scan it's not even on the servers it's only on the client devices if your servers are internet facing they will be they will come under the external scan again um, it's not a penetration test I hope that is clear Cyber Essentials Plus is very, very basic certification, right? It's not complicated. It's like, an, um, and also um, it, only, it only checks these five controls, nothing else. It's like an MOT for your car. You check your exhaust, you check your brake lights, you check your brake pads, you know, tires, so on and so forth. If, you're, um, if your seats are ripped or <laughs> If you have something else, it's nothing to do with MOT, right? If your, um, I don't know, if your door is bent, <laughs> um, 
these are the controls we, 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 we look for and these are the only ones we check for. That's it. I hope that helps. Um, so in, in short, most companies, patch management, uh, if you think you have it in place, it's easy to uh, go through. Thank you very much. <laughs>